suppose n processes p1 to pn share m identical resource units which can be reserved and released one at a time the maximum resource requirement of process pi is si where si is greater than 0 so process p1 maximum requirement is s1 and process p2 maximum requirement is s2 and so on process pn maximum requirement is sn resources which one of the following is a sufficient condition for ensuring that deadlock does not occur so what can happen is that in the worst case all the processes they require one less resource than their maximum requirement that means if the maximum requirement of p1 is s1 suppose it is acquiring s1 minus 1 p2 has acquired s2 minus 1 pn has acquired sn minus 1 resources so each of these processes they need one more resource to complete their execution so this can be the worst case now all of this the sum of all the resources that have been allocated to these processes it should be less than m which is the total number of units what if it was equal to m if the sum of all these allocated resources was equal to m then that means there are no additional resources left to be given to these processes and then the uh, the system would be in a deadlock that means the sum of all of these resources that each of these processes are holding should be less than m so this is the condition to be ensured that deadlock never occurs that the sum of all of these for i is equal to 1 to n for all the processes it should be less than m if it is less than m even if it is 1 less than m so that one extra resource can be given to any of these processes that process can execute and exit it can release its resources and then the other processes can subsequently take those resources and finish their execution so this is the necessary condition that needs to be ensured now if we do si minus 1 for i is equal to 1 to n the sum of this for i is equal to 1 to n would be n so that means the necessary condition is i is equal to 1 to n si minus n should be less than m or if we take this n to, to, to the right hand side it would become summation of the resources that all the processes require should be less than m plus n so this is the necessary condition the answer the option c is the necessary condition which is to be ensured for the deadlock to not occur